Hi everyone, my name is Justin Odisho, and in this Adobe Premiere Pro CC tutorial, I'm going to show you a quick way to do a crop, open, or close transition effect. So I'm sure there's more than one way you can do this, but a quick way that I like to do it is have the clip that you want on your timeline and ready, and in order to crop it in and out, we're going to find the crop effect. So you can actually find this under the video effects, but a quick tip whenever you're looking for effect is you can actually just search using the search bar. So if I search crop, we'll find it under the transform folder. So I'm going to click and drag this effect onto my clip or sequence, and you should see it pop up in the effect controls panel. Now I can adjust the crop parameters. So you have left, top, right, or bottom. So you can crop it in from all sides. Now we're going to go to the very start of the clip to create that opening crop transition. And we're going to affect the top and bottom sides. So turn on the animation keyframes, and then you want to start the very beginning of the clip. So make sure you're either scrubbed to the beginning, or you can use the arrow keys on your keyboard to get to the beginning. And set each of the top and bottom crops to 50%. And what that does is if you crop the top and bottom both to 50, is it essentially closes the clip. And you should see all black. Then you want to take the scrubber and move it over however long you want your sequence to be. So you could do a one second transition, you could do a two. I'll just do a little bit over one second. And then I'll take those back down to 0%. And since keyframes are still on, it'll create another set of keyframes. So when it's going from fully closed to open, you'll create that transition effect. So let's play it back and see what it looks like. So that's at that speed. If you want it to be longer, you could click and drag these out. And if you also right click on your keyframes, you can adjust the way that the two keyframes transition in between each other. Here we have a linear movement, but you can do things like ease in or ease out to create a different pattern of speed. So that's the opening. And then the same thing goes for the exit. If you get to the end of the clip and you want to close it out with the crop, uh, you can do the whole thing over again with the keyframes and percentages, except you would start your first set of keyframes at 0%. So you'd click a 0 and just press Enter to create the keyframes. Then get to the very end of the clip or where you want the crop to finish, and then turn things back up to 50. Alternatively, you could just copy the keyframes and paste them over so you don't have to continue doing the work if you're using the same keyframes. So there's the open crop and then the clip would play out how you wanted it to and then you could do the closing crop if you wanted so that's how to do that crop open or close transition effect if you guys like this quick tutorial check out my playlist on my channel for more premiere pro tutorials and definitely subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for all types of new creative videos from me you guys can follow me on social media at justin odisho definitely check me out on instagram and twitter and once again thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you next time